Lisa. It's Tiffany from Lularo Tiffany Sheehy. Um, you had claimed a few pairs of leggings and indicated that you'd want some shirts to match them. So I pulled together some things for you. Um, it is completely optional what you choose. If you want everything, if you want some of the things, if you want none of the things, it is totally fine with me. So we have your lovely leggings and you wanted a shirt to match with these, look at how cute these are. They are seriously the cutest. So, I pulled a few different shirt styles just to give you an idea of how versatile all these pieces are. So this one is, you didn't indicate what size you were, so I'm just gonna go off of um, your Facebook profile and if you want to you know switch them some things up we could totally do that so this is a perfect tee and if you have never seen a perfect tee before it is semi fitted up top and then has nice flow down below so all that hip area it does not hug your hips and it also has a nice slit in the side over here so it doesn't hug those love handles so nice and fitted up top has a cute little baseball tee arm stripe matching around the collar and also matches these leggings pretty perfectly. So for sizing on the perfect tee, this is a small. Perfects typically run one to two sizes larger than the norm. So a small is gonna fit medium and large. More on the upper end of large and it matches that red perfectly. This is like a beautiful heathered cranberry. So that's a small, and that is number 38. Next is another perfect. This is a large, this is gonna be probably um, a little bit loose on you, but if you like that kind of um, flowy look, I personally like perfects to be kind of big because it covers the bum area and it also covers your crotch area when you're wearing leggings. So this one's a large. And again, it matches these leggings pretty perfectly. This is even more washed out. This is almost like, I don't know, I would consider it like a, a mauve heather, like a light mauve. And this is stretchy t-shirt material. And that one is going to be number 44. And that again is a large. It's gonna fit large, extra large. It's gonna fit like a large, extra large. This one again, I couldn't help but pull this one because I love the olive green color. This is also a large. Isn't that such a beautiful olive? Throw that in. Super, super cute. Let's see, do we have a necklace to throw on with it? just to see what the completed outfit would look like. Look at how cute that is. Are you kidding me right now? And that's an olive green, large, and that is number 43. Next is, this one's a medium, perfect. Again, with the baseball style ringer stripes around the um, sleeves. Where did I put your leggings? They're around my shoulder. It's been a long day. Super cute look. Super, super cute. This medium is going to be number 42. This is again a perfect tee. Uh, this one we're getting into the Irma's. So an Irma also fits one to two sizes larger. So this size medium will fit large, extra large. This is such a cute army, like a mix of army greens. And if you want a pattern mix a little bit, this is the shirt to do it with. So you get your cute leggings and then you get the matching. Look at that. Isn't that the cutest? So this is an Irma. This is a tunic style shirt. So it has a very long scoop on the bottom and then it's a little bit, it's like a high-low. Everything covers the bum area and also the crotch area with the Irma. 
Um, if you are on the shorter side, I would definitely stick with, say you're normally in real life a medium, I would stick with the smaller sizes so extra small will fit a true life medium. So if you're on the shorter side and you don't like your shirts to be this long, I would definitely go the other way with sizing. So this is a medium. Did I lose my, I ran out of numbers. Hold on one second. Here we go. I've been doing um, consultations all morning, so I ran out of numbers. So this Irma medium is number 58, 5'8". And here is another Irma medium. This one is leggings material. So this buttery soft goodness is also the material that makes up this Irma. Cute geo pattern. This is another nice pattern mixing. It's like a teal with a blue. And I also have some surprises at the end that I think will tie everything together quite nicely. Oh wait, I have one more. And this is a Randy. A Randy is almost like a, a boyfriend cut. So it typically runs true to size, sometimes a little bit smaller because it is a straight down fit. It has a slight scoop in the back, just enough to cover the bum area. This is a large with heather gray and heathered light blue. And also matches these leggings. Isn't that adorable? This one is super, super soft, stretchy t-shirt material, like super soft, nice and light. And this is a large Randy, again, does not have any slits. It is straight boyfriend cut. And that is number 61. That Randy is 61. Now, you didn't mention anything about um, any coveralls, but I noticed that you're in New Jersey and I'm in New Hampshire and it's still kind of cold out. So I wanted to give you a couple options for coveralls just to kind of get your mind going and give you an idea of what everything looks like when it's all together. So let's, let's do this one. This is that perfect, that olive green perfect again. And we have our leggings. And then we also have, this is the Sarah. The Sarah cardigan is a full length sweater. Typically goes down to the calves. It's basically like elegant pajamas. That's what it feels like anyway. This is a gray green. Actually, since we're doing gray green, let's switch out this. We don't want to do too much green on green. You know what I'm saying? So here's that Sarah with that large perfect. That alone looks cute. And then throw this in, complete it with a necklace. <gasps> Look at that. Isn't that great? So this, um, this Sarah is a size large and Sarah's typically run true to size. So if you are a size large, this is good. This one is good for you. It's a gray green. I also have, here. Oh, I have one more Sarah that I want to show you that I think will be super, super pretty with this. And it mixes it up just a little bit with patterns. This is a Heather Black with mint. So let's see if we can find something. Boop, boop, boop. Let's do, let's do this one. All right. So this is the, the beauty, the fun part about being a LuLaRoe consultant is you basically play dress up all day. So we find fun patterns and, and textures and everything that go together nicely. Here we go. Isn't that so 
so cute. So the gray goes with the gray. Throw in the leggings. Nice pattern mixing. This is a nice staple. Um, stripes are typically a neutral. So you get your neutral stripes, you have your fun pattern, and then you have your solid right here. And then, did I have my, I think I lost my necklace. That's okay. We'll find it at some, oh, there it is. I always like to use a necklace to see how cohesive everything is. Just brings everything all together. Look at that. Isn't that so fun? And then this one, once it starts to get warm out, this is relatively light, so you can wear this in the spring. You can wear this on um, cool summer nights. You can wear it with jeans. You can wear it with shorts. You really can wear it with anything. It's nice and stretchy, nice and airy. And again, that's a size large, and that will fit pretty true to size. And then last thing I have for you, I want to make this short and sweet so you can get on with your day. I have these gorgeous, Joy Dusters. This is a mint green. I actually, let me put this down for a second. This is what I'm wearing today, is I'm wearing a Sarah and a Joy. So I'm wearing, see that? Nice little pop of color, piece of texture, and then I'm wearing my Sarah cardigan. So that full length sweater. And it just adds a little bit more of an element, a little bit of interest to an otherwise, you know, this is kind of a, a solid. This is, you know, how the, the turquoise and the peach play off of each other. Texture galore. Joys are one of my favorite for that reason, is that they're super low maintenance, but they don't look like it. They look like you actually put the effort into, you know, matching up your outfit. Make Makes you look like you know what we're doing. So if we do, let's just do, Okay, let's do, we're doing this on the fly because I wasn't expecting to do the Joy and the Sarah together, but I'm feeling it, you know what I'm saying? All right, so here's that Irma, cute. And then put together that with the Sarah. If you like green, this is gonna be your jam. That's Sarah. And then you have that pop of a joy, that lace. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Super, super pretty. Throw your necklace on there. Done. Look at that. And then this, I would say maybe not so much those leggings. You could do those leggings though, but I would say something a little bit more tame. Maybe a solid color, maybe like a gray pair with a nice pair of chunky boots on the bottom. I also have this Joy, which almost feels like cashmere. Right here, oh, this is so pretty. This is a mauve color and it feels, it's so soft. It feels like cashmere. And then if you did, you really can do, like the sky is the limit with these pieces. It's amazing. So if you do, you get your Irma, that's your high-low tunic. And you have your Joy sleeveless. And then if you threw over your, you could have, you could throw in your leggings. Where did I put those? Oh, over here, over here. Throw in your leggings. That is so much fun. So fun. Throw over your Sarah. Because again, layering is allowed. It makes you look put together. The layering pieces makes you look really put together. It makes it look like you actually thought out how you were gonna wear your outfit that day. Everything just kind of works. Everything just kind of fits together really nicely. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? 